They may sing about plain comforts, but these 10 country stars' net worth estimate in the millions. Do you want to find out what they spend their wealth for? Check out the richest country stars lineup in our video. Number 10. Kenny Chesney, 42 million. Kenny Arnold Chesney has already recorded 20 albums, with more than half ranked gold or higher. His net worth is estimated at $42 million. Most of his income comes from album and ticket sales. He is one of the most popular touring country singers. His flip-flop summer tour was the highest net country road tour. Kenny typically earns $45 million per year, and he certainly knows how to spend it. Chesney's fancy mansion in Tennessee cost him $9.2 million. This chick, 11,000 square foot house, has five bedrooms and nine bathrooms. Kenny also put in the market his posh property in the Virgin Islands for $7.9 million. And of course, as a proper country superstar, he owns some smaller estates in Nashville. Chesney's stylish estate portfolio continues to grow. He bought a classy beach house in Malibu for $5.2 million. Living by the beach takes the most out of it. Kenny thought the same and bought a lavish $3.7 million Riva Virtus yacht. Number 9. Blake Shelton, $60 million. Who would think that a guy from a small town in Oklahoma will become a super coach for The Voice Show and get the title of a sex symbol in 2017? Shelton's net worth is around $60 million and comes from his singing, songwriting, and coaching. His participation on The Voice has grown his net worth a lot. He earns more than $13 million per season guiding his team. Blake owns a 1,200-acre ten-point ranch in Tishomingo. But after having his girlfriend Gwen Stefani and her kids come around, he decided to purchase a $2.3 million estate as a wedding gift for Gwen in the same area. It's a luxury Hawaii-style lake house with a great swimming pool that even has its own bar. Blake's plans do not end there. He's going to open a restaurant and a brewery in Tishomingo as well. Tishomingo may very well turn into Sheltonville if Blake purchases one more home in that area. Number 8. Keith Urban, $75 million. Keith Urban today is a successful country singer who won four Grammy Awards so far. His coaching on The Voice Australia, judging on American Idol, and record sales contribute to his $75 million net worth. No wonder Keith can afford to buy a $39 million estate on the Upper East Side for his wife Nicole Kidman. It's a 25-foot wide Beaux Arts residence where Michael Jackson once lived. This pure gold interior design has seven bedrooms and eight bathrooms. Urban also has five classy cars of a total cost of $3.5 million. And if you play the guitar, you may be interested in his own guitar line. Number 7. Reba McIntyre, $95 million. Reba McIntyre is the winner of a number of awards and nominations. She has won 90 awards in her music and acting career and has been nominated for 200. Reba lives in Beverly Hills in a house estimated at $10 million. And in her house, there's a special room for her incredible hobby. McIntyre collects cowgirl-inspired boots and has more than 85 pairs. Most of them were designed by herself. Reba McIntyre is as stylish as she is talented. Number 6. Alan Jackson, 95 to 110 million. Alan Jackson is a living country music legend, mostly known for his honky-tonk and traditional country sounds. He had sold millions of records worldwide and was introduced to the Country Music Hall of Fame. Jackson owns a fantastic 3.5-acre lakefront property on Center Hill. The house is worth $5 million. The stunning complex contains an amazing Hampton-style mansion, a bedroom cabin, four guest houses, several garages, and even a helicopter landing area. In addition to the deluxe property, Alan Jackson owns a great collection of antique cars. His love for cars has not gone unnoticed. Ford's agency offered Jackson a multi-million dollar contract to promote Ford trucks. And that's not his only extra income. Alan earns money from his special collection of cowboy shirts and hats for the Cracker Barrel Old Country Store. The range of restaurants sells his specially released CDs, cowboy shirts and t-shirts, baseball caps and various home goods and many more. Number 5. Johnny Cash, 120 million. Johnny Cash is an icon of the country style music. Who wouldn't recognize this charming outlaw image he once had? He remains a music legend even after his death, leaving a great legacy. Johnny Cash had five children, four daughters from the first marriage, and a son, John Carter Cash, with his second wife. But almost all the money was left to his son. We can only wonder why he decided to do so, yet his daughters received only a million each. 
Johnny's offspring tried to contest the announcement in court. His 4.5 acre estate is now in the market with an expected price of $3 million. But how can you really estimate the place where Johnny's greatest hits were written? Number four, Garth Brooks, 240 to 280 million. Garth Brooks was named best-selling artist in line with the records of the Beatles and Elvis. But for the record, he paid almost half of his net worth for a divorce settlement to his first wife. They were married for 10 years and have three daughters, but his feelings for another country singer, Trisha Yearwood, was stronger. Yet Garth did not leave his children. Instead, he stayed with them while they were schooling. Today, being a man of his word, he is selling a $3.5 million house in Oklahoma, as he promised his wife Trisha to move when his daughters graduate school. They are also selling their family nest in Malibu for $7 million. It is a ranch-style gorgeous house with glass walls that has private access to Paradise Cove Beach. It's a single story with a formal living room, four bedrooms, three bathrooms, and a breakfast recess. It all fits 4,200 square feet. Number three, George Strait, 300 to 320 million. George Strait is considered to be the king of country and not without reason. Unlike other country stars, his career did not start in Nashville. At the age of 19, he was assigned to the U.S. Army. He started his career as country artist with the help of an Army-sponsored band. By the time he finished his service, he was an experienced songwriter and performer. Today, Strait is one of the most influential artists of his style. He was even presented with Billboard's Legend of Live Award. George's net worth is now estimated around $345 million. His gorgeous 12.2-acre adobe estate in San Antonio is now on the market. Though Strait is not disclosing the price publicly, it is estimated to be worth at least $2 million. The mansion has 14 magnificent hand-sculpted fireplaces, one in each room. Imagine the atmosphere around the house, created by unique stained glass. But his real treasure is his family. Do you agree? Number 2. Toby Keith, 360 to 365 million. Toby Keith has been listed by Forbes as the highest paid country star artist. He was reported to have earned 65 million just last year. Toby has never made less than 48 million a year. Keith owns a $19.5 million property in Oklahoma. It's a 160-acre ranch that has a huge 8,900-square-foot mansion and a two-story garage. He even has a 300-acre training facility for his newest passion, raising racehorses. He opened Toby Keith's I Love This Bar and Grill in more than 15 states. Toby is not only a singer and businessman, but also a philanthropist. He helps to restore music education in disadvantaged U.S. public schools. It's clear Keith chooses to invest not just in business, but in the future generations too. Number 1. Dolly Parton, 500 million. Dolly Parton is indeed a country music living legend. Forbes named her the richest female singer ever. Parton invested her money into the theme park, Dollywood, in Tennessee. It has 2.5 million visitors annually, even after 30 years. The park also features Dollywood Splash Country water recreations. An adult ticket for a day would cost you $67. It's a fantastic 150-acre park that continues to expand. She's complemented it with the 300-room Trendy Dream More Resort that cost her more than $300 million to invest. What spendings do you find the most unbelievable? Share your thoughts in the comments below. But we all know, money cannot buy real happiness. Thanks for watching. Click on the ASA icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel.